Hello everyone, it's Livia aka Storyminded and I am, I don't know what is happening with my camera. Um, I'm going to move on to the next video and this is to do, start to do, bleh, I cannot even speak, that's great. Um, this video is going to be about question forms with signs and another thing that I remember my lecturer telling me in my first year is kind of, so long as you're trying to like engage with um, people, um, everyone kind of has their own special way of signing so as so long as you get that essence of the sign right then even if you're slightly wrong you're still more likely to have effective communication so if you perform a sign slightly differently that's fine that's completely like acceptable it's just more so trying trying your best because it can be quite a self-conscious and a very difficult thing to when you first start signing because it's so different to anything you've done before if it's if it's not been a part of your life okay so these are some of the question forms that we've got down for this section so ask bedtime uh this one i'm not this one i'm not as confident as doing because we don't usually do it but it's um date no sorry that was me wrong Wait. Yeah, sorry, that's me writing it down wrong in the book, so it should be. Arrive, university, date, and then you would go on to sign like your month and the year, but that includes numbers and months, and I'm not going to cover that in this video. Um, this means leave or go, it's interchangeable, so leave, go. Um, so you can do leave in, university, date. Um, how long? Then we have early or late, which is very easy to get mixed up. Um, how? So like how something works. Last week, next week. People here, how many? Regularly students, study, them, and you would kind of imagine like with BSL it is a bit like acting sometimes, you need to imagine that you see people, but you can obviously if there were people, actual people in the room, you can like be looking at them and be like them. Um, the, I'm trying to, sorry, I'm trying to show it better on the camera, but like you create a little gap with your hand and then this is like this week. Uh, wake up and then the other one is like that's if you're like tired but that's like wake up tired so that would be like that sign if you're not sure what a sign is we once again one that we use a lot um and then obviously you have that means what that was a really bad non-manual feature uh when where my, one of my favourites, which, who, so that's different to around, I remember once my lecturer, it was like, I was waiting to be picked up, and um, <laughs> I signed to him, see you who, and I meant see you around, but I realised that who is when you have your nail presented, and around is the other way, and I was like, no, but he knew what I meant, but I was like, I, I, I could just, he didn't even correct me, but I knew in my head, I was like, darn it <laughs> and then um why and then obviously you have you and then you have now and then today which is almost like the syllables is how i remember it so you've got like now so you could say here now which would have been a helpful sign to have when i was working as a ta just to teach some kids some bsl could have been like <laughs> here now and then today it's like a double bump Anyway, if anyone's watched this, thank you, and I hope it helps in some way. Sorry, I was just getting distracted by my cat who was moving. Bye.